everybody. Today I'm talking about a game called Rough and Ready on the Commodore 64. It came out in 1990 by High Tech Software. Now this is one of the few games that I played that are High Tech Software. And this is a very good game. I like this game very much. Now some background history on this. This was not made of game characters or anything. This was actually a late 1950s cartoon. And it was one of those cartoons that had like 5 minutes or 10 minutes to it. And there was a lot of parts to it. Now I've never watched it as a kid simply because, well, it came out like 20 years before I was born. <laughs> but I do love the music and intro to this game. And funny enough, it's the only music and intro to this game. Let's play some Rough and Ready. Now, the main character you're playing is Rough, the cat. I don't know where Ready will ever come into it, but you never see him in the game. You only see him at the bottom right of the screen. Now, probably what explains that, because I cannot pass this first level. The very most I ever got past is on to the second level, and this is actually my third attempt now. Now, the main objective is is to collect all the blue robots like that last blue robot I just collected and get to the end of the level. Sounds very simple, isn't it? But like I explained before, you get these baddies in very awkward positions and you cannot help but hit them. And you've got to be absolutely perfect when you jump and got to remember where all the enemies are on the screen. Funny enough, I'm doing very, very well here. I've not hit one baddie yet. Hope it continues and I can find all those lovely blue robots that's hidden around the screen. Do you know what? I think I only need one more robot now until I complete the level. Come on, come on. Oh, my first hit. That's a very bad habit, so... Let's not hit anything else and lose all my lives. Because there's only three lives and that's it, I'm dead. Usually in games, the first level is really, really easy and you can pass it on your first go. But this game, the, the level set out like it's completely and utterly the last level of the game. And could you believe this is only the first level? So could you match what the other levels are like? What makes it even worse, I just realised I'm on my last life. So one more hit of these things, well, I'm all going to die. And look, how am I supposed to get that blue robot on top of there without getting hit by any of these things? Right, let's use my mind. Let's predict what these enemies will be. Ah, I think I see a gap there. Come on. Yes. Come on. Come on. Yes. Yeah, I did it. That's a rare sight for this game. Oh, I only get one extra life to complete the level. That's not going to last me long. Let's see. It looks like level 2 to me is like in a cave or a space cave. Let's go down here. Oh, well. That flashing rock's obviously hot burning lava or dangerous, so avoid that. Now let's try and see. See? Come on, I've got to jump over here. Oh. Well, I think that's enough of rough and ready for me. Because otherwise it drive me insane. Well, that's it for me. Goodbye, everybody, and take care.